All right, so here we are today. We're out in the patch. We're going to get the, the uh, giant pumpkin seed, now a plant, into the ground and we'll show you how to get it to grow the direction that you want it to go. Um, it's pretty predictable and we're going to dig us a little trench to put it in to make sure that it goes where we want it to. So we're going to start off right here. We'll dig a little hole. You want to dig it plenty deep. Um, generally, if the soil wasn't so wet, we'd want to put some water in here and give that root a really good drink to start with. And it's always best when you take these out of the pot to make sure that they're just dripping wet. They'll come out of the plant or out of the pot a whole lot easier generally. This one has a lot of roots coming out. We're going to see if we can salvage those as they come out. And perfect. You can see the length of the root on this plant already is really going. And just amazing the, the root base they have. So this guy here, um, it's long enough that it's real easy to tell where he wants to go. Um, so it'd be real easy to figure out. But what we want to do is we want to dig this hole really deep and want to plant it clear down in below the soil level so we can create a, an area right here that'll hold water. We can fill this as a reservoir to hold water. And then we'll just backfill this. We want to make sure the soil is real soft so we don't uh, tear up the root. And we'll just bury them in here. And then this vine right here is going to take off and I want it to grow in a diagonal way here, so what I'm going to do is just move this soil out of the way here. We want to dig this down. I like to go about six inches. And dig that down like that. And then as this vine starts to grow, I'm going to lay it in there and I'm going to start backfilling this vine so just the leaves, about that much of the leaf is sticking out. It'll grow away from it at the end of the vine, maybe six or eight inches of the vine, and then these leaves, you want them to come up out of the soil to bury that good and deep. And what it's gonna do, at every, every leaf axial here, it's gonna send a big old tap root down. Everywhere that a leaf joint is, it'll send another main root down. So you can put fertilizer right here um, when you're burying it, right on top of the leaf axial and just let it leach down as you water it. And, uh, We'll get that all buried in there. You put your fertilizer, whatever your fertilizer of choice would be, put it down in the, the trench as you go along. And these plants, when they really get to grow, and they'll grow six, eight, 10 inches a day pretty easy once they really take off. So right now, we're just kind of a waiting game, but I've decided I want this plant to go this way. Uh, I know that I need about 10 to 12 feet where I'm gonna put the pumpkin at, where I'm gonna let it set. So this is the direction I've chose for it to go. And now I just wait until it grows some more. 